Starting a Shopify store sounds like a huge, complicated project, right? Weeks of planning, endless design work, and hours spent learning how to set everything up. But here's the truth. You can get a functional, professional-looking Shopify store up and running in about 15 minutes. And with the Shopify free trial, you can do it without paying a cent up front. That's not hype. It's just knowing which steps actually matter when you're getting started. The biggest mistake beginners make is overcomplicating the launch. They think they need to perfect every single detail before their store goes live. The reality? You just need a clean, functional setup that lets you start selling. Everything else can be improved over time. So, here's the plan. Step 1. Claim your Shopify free trial using the link in the description. This gives you full access to Shopify's platform, not some limited preview. You'll be able to list products, customize your design, process orders, and connect your payment options exactly like a paying customer. The only difference is you're not paying yet. Once you've got your free trial, the first thing you'll see is the Shopify dashboard. This is your control center, the place where you'll manage products, orders, and customers. But before you get lost exploring every option, head straight to the themes section. Pick one of Shopify's free templates. Don't overthink it. These themes are already mobile optimized, easy to customize, and designed to convert. Next, upload your logo. If you don't have one yet, use a free tool like Canva to create something simple. Then go into your theme settings and add your brand colors and fonts. This quick step instantly makes your store look more professional and yours, even if it's still in the early stages. After that, add your first product. This can be something you already have in stock, a dropshipping product, or even a digital download. The goal here isn't to have a full inventory. It's to get your store functioning. Add a clear product title, a short but engaging description, and at least three good quality images. Then, set up your payment options. Shopify integrates with major payment processors like Shopify Payments, PayPal, and Stripe, so you can start accepting orders instantly. Make sure to add shipping rates, too. Even if you're offering free shipping, you still need to configure it so customers can check out without issues. Finally, click that View Your Store button. You'll see a live version of what customers will see when they visit. This is the moment most beginners realize they actually have a store. In 15 minutes, you've gone from nothing to something real and sellable. Now, here's where the magic happens. Once you have that basic store live, you can start improving it piece by piece while still inside your Shopify free trial. This is the part most beginners overlook. They think they need to spend weeks behind the scenes perfecting every detail before they launch. But when you get your store online quickly, you can start learning from real feedback and real traffic right away. In the first day or two after your store is live, share the link with friends, family, or any online groups you trust. Ask them to go through the buying process even if they don't purchase. Get feedback on what's confusing, what looks great, and what might need work. This early input is priceless because you're seeing your store through the eyes of your customers. Next, focus on your homepage. It's the first impression people get and Shopify's drag and drop editor makes it easy to update. Add a banner image, feature your best selling or most eye catching product, and include a short headline that tells visitors exactly what your store is about in one sentence. Don't try to cram in everything. Clarity beats clutter. Once that's set, use the built in analytics in Shopify to see how visitors are interacting with your site. Are they clicking on your featured product? Are they dropping off at checkout? Even with just a little bit of traffic, these insights will guide your next moves. One huge advantage of the Shopify free trial is that you can experiment without financial pressure. Try running a small ad campaign on Facebook or Instagram with a $5, $10 daily budget just to see who clicks. Test different product photos or headlines and track which ones convert better. Each tweak you make now can lead to higher sales later, and you're not losing money to a subscription while you learn. By the end of your free trial, you'll ideally have your first real customers and a clear sense of what's working. When it's time to choose a paid plan, you'll be doing it with confidence, knowing you're already on the right track. The key takeaway? Don't wait. The fastest way to start learning and earning is to get your store live as soon as possible, even if it's not perfect. Shopify makes it simple enough that 15 minutes is all you need to have a store ready to share with the world. So click the link in the description, start your Shopify free trial, and launch your store today. The sooner you start, the sooner you'll see just how far you can take it.